Hi, this is Kevin Souza. Welcome back to video number 37 on my faults and challenges and my shortcomings and my mistakes and the lessons I've learned from them. And I'm learning as I'm doing these videos, trust me, <laughs> 37 videos and wow, uh, it's amazing when you let loose and just let the world know your problems and, and, and let the world know your faults and what you're working on on yourself in life. You know, uh, initially when I first thought of the idea of letting people know what my faults are, uh, I literally abhorred that. I, I was like, no, I, I can't do that. I'm, I'm very uncomfortable to, to let people know what my faults are. And, uh, uh, but then as I started doing videos, uh, I kind of endured it a little bit. And, uh, uh, and, then, and then finally now, uh, I don't know how many videos it took, but now I'm embracing it. And you know, that's the way it is in life with your comfort zones. Okay, when someone's first introduced to an idea, uh, let's say for example, and I, I like to use this example because I, I did it myself. Um, when, when I first took a look at a way to make some extra money in life, I was against it because I had no money to spend or I thought I didn't um, because I didn't believe that what I would join would work. Um, and so I just, just, no, no, I just don't have the money for that. And uh, so I was against it. I abhorred it. Uh, but then, you know, I, I, I thought, well, what if I could make some money at this? So, well, then I kind of endured the idea and said, okay, um, let's figure out how I can get the money for it. I was making $40 a week as a part-time security guard in college. And, uh, and then finally, uh, when I said, you know what, uh, how much is it to start? I don't know. I think it was like $100 for the kit or something like that. I scraped up the money and I bought it. So I embraced the idea. That, when I was 19 years old, was the best decision I have ever made in my entire life of 55 years. Because I learned the art of doing something outside of my comfort zone. Most people don't do that. No, no, I don't want to do that. Okay. Why? Why? Because you're going to get out of your comfort zone. Okay. Um, but that's the, the process. You first, when you're introduced to an idea, you abhor it. And then you endure it. And then you embrace it. You know, many criminals are the same way. At first, they, were, they, they abhor the idea of doing something wrong. And then because they're associating with other criminals, they endure it, and then they embrace it, sadly. So it works both positively and negatively. But we all have a comfort zone that we work in. And you know what happens when you get out of your comfort zone? You've actually expanded it, and now your comfort zone is larger than it was. But that uncomfortableness, oh, that's not me, I don't do that. Of course, you abhor the idea, but if you endure it and then embrace it, you expand your comfort zone. And that's what I did when I made the decision to find a way to start earning some legitimate income on the side uh, back when I was 19 years old. And we all have a comfort zone. And some people will adamantly and just emphatically refuse to get out of that comfort zone. And when you do that, you put yourself in a box. And, you know, those same people, some of them are like, I don't care if I'm in a box. I'm just not doing that. I'm not interested in that. Okay. And they won't change the way they think. You know, we talked about change. Change, growth, and modification are inevitable characteristics of an effective human being. You know, decide to do something different. And I'm going to talk about that in the next video, you know, doing something new. And we'll expound on that. So the next video, video 38, we'll, we'll discuss, you know, do something new because it'll expand your comfort zone. So try not to fall into the trap that I did for many years of living within my comfort zone. Be open to learning new things and doing new things. And learning how, okay? Take your preconceived notions and ideas about things and open your mind because our, our minds are like umbrellas. I said this before. They don't work unless they're open. And you've all heard that before, right? So expand your comfort zone. You can do it. And help other people in, this, in the meantime besides helping yourself. Click the link below and join me. Expand your comfort zone, okay? Learn with me. I'm still learning. I still have faults that I need to fix and mistakes that I made that I need to correct and solutions to problems that I have. So do you. So does everyone else.
I'll look forward to talking with you in the next video. This is Kevin Souza. Make it a wonderful day.